Okay. Let's just get right to it. Before I do my comments, I guess like a good YouTuber does. Well, maybe not. That's a whole other conversation. Whatever. I do agree. I don't, even, I don't even know how to start this. Let, let's just start with the video. Let's just start with the video. Let's just start with the video. I, I don't even know. This is the video I made. Trying to pick which console to play. You know, it's a little TikTok video. Nothing crazy. Still, it's, it's nothing. It's just a silly little video for TikTok. It's crazy. <laughs> So I just made the video, the trend, the song's cool, whatever, making a little joke out of which system to play. You know, actually, you can clearly see the PS5 is on because I was playing Last of Us, the Last of Us remastered, uh, you know, the, the part one, the remastered one, which, you know, Xbox usually does win. I'm not going to lie. I don't really play my PS5 as much, but I probably would if I paid for the online. I would say that would be a fair statement, but I like the exclusives, you know, I like God of War. You know, I like the Last of Us series. Obviously, you know, we got Uncharted. I haven't played that in years, but, you know, we, we got our exclusives. Horizon Zero Dawn, you know, which is great. So, I, I you know, the Ratchet and Clank game was amazing. You know, and there's still some titles that I like to play. You know, older games, too, that you can get. Like the Remastered Jack series and stuff like that. Spyro, Crash Bandicoot. So, that's why I usually, mostly use my PS5 for. I feel like the value I get out of it for single-player games is way better. Xbox just has a way better online platform. But anyways, so I'm going to the comments. And this guy, I'm not going to lie. I'll shout him out. Alexandro, Alexander Rosario. If you're watching this, I hope you do. Let's look at this. Xbox trash. This guy says, okay, tell me why. He says, okay, he was ready. This guy was ready. First, you need to use batteries to charge... To charge your trash. I mean, Xbox controllers. Which... He's 100% right. So, this is my original Xbox Series X controller. And I don't even think I had the system for a year yet. I'll have to look at my TikTok videos to see when I did the unboxing and setting it up and stuff like that. Because I made a video on it. And I gotta find it. And this controller is already broken. It has a huge stick drift. I tried fixing it. The analog here. Whatever. I tried fixing it. And it's a huge stick drift. Like, if I play Call of Duty and I let go of it, I'm just going like this. I'm literally just going straight up with the gun. I'm like, yo, what the fuck? So if I'm holding it and moving it, like, it's good. But as soon as I let go, it goes up. So it's like, it's obnoxious. And this is, this is, and it's not even a year old. And the control still looks good. Like, I, like, it looks clean for the most part. So it's like, whatever. So what I did was I went on Amazon and I bought a wired controller because, well, another reason, the batteries. This one has batteries in it right now, but since I don't use it as much, because I still use it sometimes, like for basic stuff, if I have this controller, the wired one too, because I use this for my PC and my Xbox Series X as well, I should get another one, so I get like less usage on it, because you know, I, I game a lot obviously. So, yeah, the controllers are trash, and this has batteries in it, so that's why I got the wired one, it's plugged into my Xbox Series X right now, but yeah. And this will probably break soon. I'm on, let's see, I have another controller here, right? This is for, I was using this on my PC. I would plug it in and use it on my PC. But this is, this was the third controller I bought for my Xbox Series, no, the Xbox One S, which is behind me. It's on my shelf. I don't think you could see it from the camera. Yeah, you can see it actually next to the Minecraft explodey guy, where the fuck his name is. And this is my third controller for this console specifically. I had the original one, which the analog broke. Then I got another wired one, which was $20. So I was like, fuck it, I'll get a cheap one because these shits break anyways. Then after that, I bought this third one. And I had the and I had the Xbox One S for a couple years. But even then, I mean, come on, bro. Guys, I literally have, where is it? My PlayStation 2 controller is behind me. Since 2001, that's the original controller I had with that PS2 right there, and it still works. But it does have one problem with the with the button in the middle, the digital button. Sometimes the analogs turn off and on if I jerk it too much or it vibrates too hard. But I just turned off the vibration and the options. That's good. But so it's like a little loose, whatever. But other than that, the controller works fine. That's the original controller for the PlayStation 
PlayStation um fucking 2. Like, bruh. This is the PS5 controller right here. No problems with it yet. But then again, I don't play as much on it. But I have years and hours and hours of playing with that PS2 controller. Way more than any Xbox controller ever. Because I've had that system for since it came out. So obviously I was playing a shit ton as a kid. And every once in a while, I still play Jack 3. I still got the Ratchet and Clank games, as you can see back there. And I would play a shit ton of games on that. I, I don't think there's an amount of hours I can be playing that. And I'll still play that every once in a while. It's been a couple months since I turned it on. But, bro, the, the, the Xbox controllers are trash. Plus, you got the batteries. And then they, they break. He's he's on point. I, I can't refute these that first one. It's it's 100% right. It's, it's, it's just sad. Like... When when I first opened up the Xbox on the reveal video, when I first opened it, right? That it's funny. It says "Power your dreams, bitch." Th these batteries are not in my dreams. I'm wasting money. It's, it's Duracell. They're like, oh, can we please have your controllers? You know, whatever. Like, nah, I'm I'm done. Like, it's 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 ridiculous. Anyways, let's move on. So, a second point is on PS4 or PS5, you don't have the five or three rings of death. But on Xbox, you do. So, on the Xbox, that was only on the Xbox 360. So, I mean, I'm not sure what he's referring to on this specifically. But I was on, and I actually got the Red Ring of Death on my original Xbox 360. I still have my Xbox 360 Elite. It's out of the case because it actually was overheating. And but it still works now. I took the case off, and it works perfectly. I still have my Guitar Hero controller, as you can see right there. I'll play on it every once in a while. I should stream that. I think that would be a good stream. Anyways, so that still works. And then, finally, the graphics are trash, and it's so laggy. That's not true. That's not true. To be honest, I have both systems right here in front of me. Xbox Series X, PS5. They're, I think they're the same. I would say they're about the same, in my opinion. I've played them both enough. They're both fast. Graphics are really good. Um, I think the only thing, so Xbox is winning the Xbox Game Pass. I know we have that PS Plus Pass, whatever. Excuse me, I looked at it. I thought it was trash. Uh, it's like the games, like, eh, like, eh, at best. Xbox Series X, like, the games you can play with your friends and just everything is just better. So they're winning on that, but... What PS5 is winning on is their controller. That PS5 controller feels comfortable. It's a little big, I would say. But other than that, this controller is solid. I love it. I love the PS5 controller. The way it just feels in my hand. It feels smooth. Like, the tension when I'm playing, like, The Last of Us or Ratchet and Clank. It's nice. It's it's just an all-around good controller. I really like them holding it right now. I just, I just like holding it. It just feels smooth. Like, it feels it feels more, like, like premium. A little bit but then even when i hold like this controller the xbox controller it just feels it feels rough it just feels different i don't know even the buttons like it feels cheap like you hear that sound it just it just doesn't and then you got like tell me that doesn't sound better the triggers the bumpers come on that's like a little bit asmr asmr what is it right but th that sounds sounds amazing but then this is the series x it even even feel you could feel it like there's nothing the triggers are a little better but there's nothing here and even with this controller i bought on amazon for like 30 dollars it's actually a little bit better i'm not gonna lie the bumpers actually feel a little more solid like it won't break i play a lot of dead by daylight so if you play dead by daylight we're working on gens it's always the right bumper this shit is, like, messed up as well, I think. I think it was this one that was messed up on the bumper, too. Or was it? No, I think it was this one. I'm pretty confident it was. That's another reason why. I had to stick drift and a controller. And all I do is hold. I don't even hold it hard. But anyways. So, and then, yeah, that's all he says. So, those are your three reasons. So, the first one is a very fair and honest critique. So, he's obviously had an Xbox. Maybe now he has a PS5. But, you know, obviously I don't know this guy. But... I'm gonna, you know, I'm just recording this video now, and I'm gonna tell him I made a video about it. Let's go. But his first point is good. It's valid. So I'm gonna like his comment, and I think, oh, there's another one. Nah, Xbox more like trash box. This guy put a, put a, put a clown. I, I don't, 
I don't know, someone explained to me what the fuck that means. And I said, well, we all have our opinions. Unfortunately, yours is wrong. And then he didn't say anything. So, sorry, Pizza John. Anyways, everything else is like, uh, whatever. I don't really care. Some of y'all got too much money. Yeah, I guess so. That's what I spent my money on. Anyways, I'm going to end the video there. That's the context. Um, Like and subscribe, I guess. I don't care.